super informal, just sitting on the floor hanging out. Um, you know, sometimes I just want to be more relaxed. But anyways, look at my bun. Mm. Work it, work it, work it, work it. But in this Ipsy bag are my new items for my project pan. And I want to, I guess, tell, tell you guys about it. So I'm doing, I don't even know how many products are in here. My deadline is... What was I going to get myself? All of October, all of November, and all of December. So New Year's. New Year's. So the, how many products do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six by New Year's. Woo! <laughs> I found with my last project pan, which I'll link below. Um, I just had the finale for it. Basically, three months is perfect time to kind of work through products. Are you going to finish all of them in three months? Maybe not, but you're going to make it through you know, half or more if you're using them every day. So let me go into the products that I'm going to use. And where should I start? I'll start with face. So right here is the Smashbox BB Cream. This is in what color? Light. And it has an SPF of 35. Products that have SPF in them expire and maybe like two years or so, I'm not really sure, um, but I've had this one for over a year, so it's kind of the next product to be used up. So I'm going to give myself three months and see how I feel about it. Um, if I am over it, I might just let it go after that time, if it's, especially if it's starting to wear funny, but we'll see. But my plan is to finish all of it, and I do have like a little bit of a dent in it already, so... Um, I don't really know, it's hard to tell, but I'm probably around, like, maybe here. So right above the S of Smashbox. So that's item number one. Item number two is a sample from Ipsy. It is the Perlease right here, and it is an Ultra Skin Brightening Serum. And this uh, has vitamin C. So this should be pretty easy to go through. I don't know yet if it's like a cream or it has a seal on it. I don't know if it is a cream or like a liquid. I'm not really sure. But I, I feel pretty confident that I could finish this in probably a month or two. Probably will not take the full three months. The next item that I have is an illuminator. I did do an illuminator in my last one and I really like mixing it in with my foundations or CC creams or moisturizer. Um, what do you sit down, my dog? But I have really dry skin, so I really like the look. So the next one I'm going to use is from Becca, and this is an opal right here. This came in the three set. And you can still get that on HSN Home Shopping Network's website. It's $25 for three of these. And I think I am to about, it's hard to tell, but that's like where there's kind of something showing. So I'm somewhere around there. It's hard to mark. I basically want to use it all up, and I feel like I probably could in three months. If you want to see a little swatch of it. So that's, this is what it looks like before you blend it in. It's kind of like a pink gold color, and then you blend it in. And it's just a really nice illuminator. I hope that's showing up for you. But these are nice just to put like on the high points of your face. They're good to mix into moisturizers or whatever, like I just said. So there's that. Three more items. This I tested out last week. This is the NYX Milk Crayon, Jumbo Crayon right here. I tested this out last week to see if I liked it as an eye base, and I do. So I put it on my eyelid, and then I use a Real Techniques blending brush to kind of push it in. And I like this, and I don't know, I mean, um, you know, obviously there's a good amount left in it, so I'm not, I don't know what's realistic for finishing this, so this will be a surprise item. Will I finish it? I don't know. Okay, so everyone's doing like a pan that palette, which... Rest in peace, all those beautiful palettes being pant. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of people and so sad at the same time. But anyways, I know that I could not pan a palette. I just get bored so freaking easily. But with that in mind, I like where people's heads are with it. So I've been thinking like, hmm, like actually using up eyeshadows in my collection. Like that's a novel idea. 
So what I'm going to do is right here, this is Physician's Formula uh, Quad, and this is in Classic Nudes. And so my goal for this is to use up this ivory color right here as a base for all of my eyeshadows. I feel pretty confident that I could use that up pretty quickly because it might be a good under eye setting powder as well. I'll have to test it out as that. If I do happen to finish this up before the three months is up, then I'm going to move into this kind of lighter tan color and use it in the same, well, as an eyeshadow base. That might not be a good setting powder. It could be contour though. You know, I'm just going to play and that's the thing I've learned about the painting stuff is you need to just play with things and use things in a different way than they might be marketed to use as. So this is my primary goal. If I reach it and it's gone, then I'm going to go to this one. Alright, and I might use the other ones in between, but if we're talking about goals, those are my goals. And then the final product is a blush. This came in Ipsy right here. It's from Model Co. And it is um, Cosmopolitan. Blush is okay. It's just like a very everyday natural blush. I don't know how realistic it is to finish this. I know I could use it as an eyeshadow. Um, you know, there's different uses. Well, I guess eyeshadow and blush are like the only uses. But I don't know what to expect. It's another surprise item. I don't know if I can realistically go through it in three months or maybe I would just hit pan. Um, but we'll see what happens. So those are my six items. I'm not going to show them in my weekly makeup baskets anymore just because it makes the video so long and it's so redundant every time. So I am just going to do um, monthly updates up until New Year's Eve and hopefully I have all of these products done and then I can start going into um, another project. Oh, oh I forgot. I'm doing seven products. <laughs> I totally forgot I did, this was um, with my old project pan. This is the NYC Smooth Skin Sunny Bronzer. I didn't finish it. I made a lot of progress on it, but I still have a lot of product left in it. So I am going to do this. So that's seven products. I can't believe I forgot it. So it's seven by New Year's Eve. Oh my gosh. So wish me luck. Every month I'll do updates. I won't be showing it in my weekly basket anymore. And... Yeah, if you're doing project pants, let me know. I love watching them. I love seeing the finales. I'm like, what did you do? Um, so cheer me on. Let me know what advice you have. Let me know if you're doing one. I'd love to watch you and cheer you on. And until my next video, I'll see you guys later. Bye.